Oh, from Jesus doing marvelous things. Lord, we give you praise. Hallelujah. So sorry I'm coming up late tonight. If you just enter the house this morning, just begin to give him praise. Appreciate the beauty of his holiness. He is a good and kind God. Glory, glory, we praise your name. You are the Lord. 
blessings forever. Ooh. Beautiful God doing beautiful things. Indeed, He has turned our lives around. Lift up your voice this morning. Say, Help me, Lord, help me. Oh, yes. Yeah. Say, Help me, help me, Lord, help me. He's a faithful king. The I am that I am. 
the lion of the tribe of Judah. He has done great things. He has done great things. He has done great things. To God be the glory. Great things he has done. So loved he the world that he gave us his son. Hallelujah. We yielded his life and atonement for sin and opened the life gate that all may go in. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Let the earth hear his voice. Child of God, lift up your voice. Say, help me, Lord, help me. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Let the people rejoice. Oh, come to the Father, to Jesus, the Son. Give him the glory. Great things he has done. He's awesome. Mm -hmm. He's faithful. Mm -hmm. Beautiful in all his ways. Doing marvelous things. Mm -hmm. Doing great things. Hallelujah. This is another day that the Lord has made. We have come before Him. But I want us to come with rejoicing. And I want us to be glad in it. Because this is a beautiful week. In this week, the Lord will do great things. In this week, the Lord will do awesome things. The Lord will do beautiful, awesome things this week to the glory of His holy name. This is that week that you have long waited for. That week where the Lord will frustrate every activity of the enemy mm -hmm. targeted towards you. This week, anybody calling your name for evil will end up with complete shame. In the name of Jesus. God is no respecter of persons. If you run to him, he will run to you. Oh yes. I tell you the truth. If you run to this God, he will also run to you. This is the season that the Lord will put to shame everything that has tried to put you to shame this week this week the lord will frustrate everything that has tried to frustrate you everything that has tried to frustrate you will be frustrated in this week Everything that has tried to fight your glory in this week, the Lord will put them to shame. This is a week that you have to be very sensitive. Oh yes, you have to operate in high wisdom this week. Because the Lord will do great things. The Lord will do awesome things. The Lord will do beautiful things. In this week. In this week. The Lord will do awesome things. The Lord will do beautiful things. And the Lord will also do what? Great things. Great things. Hallelujah. Now, 
this morning, I will want to extensively make you understand the mantle. Because tomorrow is the night we'll be praying on the mantle. It's tomorrow. Tomorrow is our seed sowing night. Tomorrow, everybody in the house will be picking a scripture prophecy. Indeed, it has been awesome. These 40 days, the Lord has done great things. If you believe that the Lord has done great things, can I hear you say, the Lord has done great things. The Lord has done great things. The Lord has done great things. Hallelujah. Before I begin, I want you to lift up your voice and say, Visit me with great favor. Visit us with great favor. Now, the Bible made us to understand That the thief will always come to steal. But I pray for you this season. He will not be able to steal your great favor. Your great favor has indeed come to stay. Every agenda of the enemy. To push that favor back. Mm -hmm has failed. Whatever the Lord does, I know is forever. I know is forever. Child of God, a warrior indeed, is he who does not get satisfied with little victories? No. And in this season, you're going to have a major victory. A major victory. A major victory. One of us in the house. Somebody she had paid for to do something for her, all of a sudden made up his mind that I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to give you your money and there's nothing you can do about it. Mm -hmm. Of course, when she said it to me, I thought that you will not need to fight in this battle. You shall hold your peace and the Lord will fight for you. That will be a lot of people's testimony in this season. Your testimony this season shall be, you will hold your peace and the Lord will fight for you. And so that was exactly what happened. That was exactly what happened. She said, I was not even the one that told her to do that. But I told her that she will hold her peace and the Lord will fight for her. She said she wrote the man's name in a piece of paper and took the communion we have been praying for all this on, on, mm -hmm. on all this one and poured on it. Two days later, the man was the one calling her. Madam, please, so when do you want your job? When should I come? If you don't want me to do the job, let me give you your money. <laughs> 
it is possible for the angel of the Lord to pursue them. This year, the angel of the Lord will pursue your pursuers to the glory of the living God. You have been compassed around that mountain long enough, it is time for you to move forward and you will move forward. Every agenda of the enemy for you not to move forward has failed. You will move forward. Hallelujah. But first of all, this morning, lift up your voice and begin to tell the Lord, I love you. I love you, Lord. I love you. Oh, yes. I love you. 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 Lift up your voice. Oh, lift up your voice. Lift up your voice. Say to him, I love you. He's an awesome king. He's an awesome king. Thank you, Jesus. Maladora Padre. Pazo Kodobole Brada Padre. Hmm. The Lord will show up for you. This year, the Lord will show for you. Now, I want you to know that scriptures cannot be broken. You serve an awesome God. The Lord that created these beautiful things with the greatness of His might, strong in power, He will fight for it. He will fight for you. He will fight for you. Oh yes. Now. In this season. Hallelujah. In this season, your enemy will submit. Okay. If you believe what I'm saying, say hallelujah. Because someone said the scriptures cannot be broken. Psalm 66, verse 3, it says, Say unto the Lord, how terrible art thou in thy works. Through the greatness of thy power shall thy enemies submit themselves unto thee. Child of God, you belong to God. And the power of God will work in your life. It will speak for you. Your enemies will submit to you. Amen. Because scriptures cannot be broken and God cannot lie. Yes. This year, every enemy of your glory will submit. They will submit. Are you there this morning? Are you there? Let me tell something to you. After this time out, the devil will leave your space. He will leave your space. He will leave your space. I tell you the truth. But you need to operate in the knowledge of what is for you. Can someone say, I'm blessed? I'm blessed. From today, 
Tell everybody that cares to listen that you are blessed. Because remember, I told you that what you say matters. That you need to say what you want to say. You need to say the things you want to say. Hallelujah. Say it as a confirmation. Every day of my life, I am blessed. My children are blessed. My husband is blessed. My brothers are blessed. My sisters are blessed. We are blessed. We are blessed. Say it and believe it. Believe it and say it. Say it and believe it. Believe it and say it. Goodness and mercy shall follow me continually. <laughs> oh yes. Say these things. You know, normally, our beginning of year in Faith Giants is usually a process. Immediately we do our 40 days and finish. We start our mm -hmm. annual 40 days daily confession. And so it's part of the daily confession I'm pushing out to you gradually. We start our 40 days daily confession. God is not a respecter of persons. The same God over all is rich unto all that call upon him. In this season, the Lord will put to shame every power that is going against his will in your life. Every power going against his will in your life. This is your year. Wonders everywhere shall be your testimony. Wonders everywhere shall be your testimony. Wonders 2019 is a reality. God is no respecter of persons. The same God over all is rich unto all that call upon him. So the Lord will frustrate everything that has frustrated you in the past and give you victory. Until you are empowered of God, exploit is far from you. But in this season, the Lord himself will empower you to do exploit. The Lord himself will empower you to do exploit. Hallelujah. Child of God, Today is the 38th night. On the 39th night, we're having our seat to him and we're having our mantle to God. And so this morning, I want to open your eyes to some mysteries. Now, I want to first of all tell you, I want to first of all ask how many of you in the house tonight desire a special miracle. How many of you in the house feel that you are long overdue for a special miracle? Some here. Say, I'm here. Hallelujah. If you're in the house tonight, and you feel 
you are part of the people that desire a special miracle. I want you to say, say Lord, I desire a special miracle. Yes. Remember that he said, what you say to my ear, that is what I'm going to give you. Praise God. Now, if that be your desire, I want to show you something in scripture. Scriptures cannot be broken. Oh yes. The same God over all is rich unto all that call upon him. Whatever you see in scripture works. Whatever you see in scripture works. The Bible says, and God wrought special miracles is a reality. Special miracles is a reality. It is possible for you to have a special miracle. Very possible. Hallelujah. It is very possible. All you need to do is to scripturally discover. Because whenever you discover, you recover. Child of God, whenever you discover, you recover. Praise God. God is no respecter of persons. The same God over all is returned to all that call upon him. The same God over all is rich unto all that call upon him. The same God over all is rich unto all that call upon him. Hear me. The devil knows his place. It is only the church that does not know the place of the devil. When you discover the place of the devil, you push him aside. Oh, yes. When you discover the place of the devil, you kick him to one corner. When you discover his place, you send him packing. God is no respecter of person. There is nothing that prayer cannot bear. There is nothing. And so, everybody in the house gets ready for a special miracle. Get ready for a special miracle. Whenever you apply scripture, child of God, you recover. I'm telling you, you recover. Scriptural application as a solution in life problems brings joy. Because that is the only solution to life problem that does not have a repercussion. You have a win-win situation in your hand. You have a win-win. Amen. There will be no place for the devil that is nothing for him to hold on to. Because that thing that is going to point to as the accuser, oh, He's already made provision for in scripture, and you will see the Lord say, My God is speaking better things. Can someone begin to shout hallelujah? Can you just begin to shout your hallelujah? Can someone just begin to shout hallelujah? Yes. Let your hallelujah be taken up to the heavens for to come. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Scriptures cannot be broken. Whenever you require a special miracle, you bring up the ministry of a man. You bring up the ministry of a man. You 
tengo que más de mí. Hear me? If you read down that Acts chapter number 19, when you get to verse 20, he told you that so mightily put the word of God and prevail. So mightily grew the word of God. The word of God prevails over every circumstance surrounding your mother. So whatever you see in the word of God can prevail over your situation. Whatever you see in the word of God can prevail over your circumstance. Whatever you see in the word of God can prevail. If you hold on to it, and keep shouting it at the highest peak of your voice, keep believing it over the circumstance and situation, it will prevail. The word of God grows. And so, in case you have not bought your home, your handkerchief, I will advise that you hurry up. Buy it because it is near. It is tonight. If I begin to give you the testimony of our mantle, of our mantle program, you'll be amazed. Some of us in the house tonight can bear witness to that fact. Can bear witness to that fact. I remember those days when, when, when America was really sending pregnant people back to Nigeria when they come to America. Because a lot of pregnant people will go to America to give birth and they will deliver and they will not pay their hospital. So, America became a mess. America became a mess. So when they see you heavily pregnant, coming into America, they send you back to Nigeria. They send you back. And so, there was one of us in the house that needed to go and give birth in America. And everybody was like, we're going to send her back at the airport. We're going to send her back at the airport. She did. the blood in your water tonight, break with it. Put the blood in your water in the morning, break with it. And just before you start going to the airport in the night, break again. That's the That there will be a witness there to your life. There will be a witness there. And that when you do that, take the mantle. I gave her three mantles. I tied the mantle together. Head to head. I said, tie it on your stomach right now. You will enter into the world. Can someone sing unto the Lord before I finish that song? Can you say, God is God. God is no man. God is God. That is no man. God is God. He is no man. He will do it for me. And I hear you say, Mm -hmm. Believe it and say it. Yes, he will do it. He will do it for me. So, I said, okay. And it was in the season of our fast like this. It was in the season of our fast. Travel the day before the feast of Jacob. During the Feast of Destitutes, when her husband came, we were all there when her call came to her. She told her husband, I have called. The man somersaulted, it's only God that made him not to somersault into our pot of food that we are using for our feast. And she said that the pregnant woman that was in front of her was 
And once she got there, my daughter said, okay, how, how long do you intend to stay in the States? All of us said, we don't know. And she entered. God is no respecter of person. That same God is here. Most of the time, when we pray for people going for visa, it is also in the man to tell them to write their passport. And Baba keeps giving us testimony. The Lord will do it for you. You will return with an evidence. Can I have someone in the house say, I must return with an evidence. 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 In the book of Acts, chapter number five, and verse fifteen. Now. I mean, this make you understand that. If someone's shadow can heal the sick, what place of mantles that are taken from the earth? The Bible says, in so much that they were brought forth the sick into the street. And lay them on beds and couches. That at the least, the shadow of Peter passing by might overshadow some of them and heal them. And guess what? They were actually, they were actually. This season, you are the one to perform the miracle because the mantle is in your hand. He said in 16, there came also a multitude out of the cities round about Jerusalem, bringing sick folk, and them which were vexed with unclean spirits, and they were healed. Everyone. Now, that was where I was going to. The everyone. The everyone was where I was going to. There's something I want to say to you tonight. I want you to believe that it's not for some people. Everyone is entitled. Everyone that will join the activities of tomorrow night, you are entitled to the same testimony. Hallelujah. Say, I will not go empty. Yes, we I will not go empty. Everyone is entitled. Everyone. 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 I 
know why I'm taking you through scriptures to see all of these things? Because scriptures cannot be broken. Scriptures cannot be broken. Now, this was Jesus himself they were talking about in this time. What were they seeking? A man to conquer. So it was just not the woman that had the issue of blood that sought the man to contact to touch the hem of his garment. Mm -mm. There was a sign that everybody was seeking the same thing. Matthew 14, 32. And besought him that they, not that she, now, that they might touch the hem of his garment. Now he said, and as many as such were made perfect in him. As many, as many, as many, as many, as many, as many, as many. Can someone say scriptures cannot be broken? Scriptures cannot be broken, God can never. So don't even tell yourself that it, it might be some people that will get this testimony. <laughs> don't present yourself. Don't present yourself. If you're in the house this morning, say, I am a partaker. Some years ago, we went to negotiate for a property. And I'd sent the national coordinator there, they went. And, uh, they, they received a no for an answer. And they came and told me. <laughs> I laughed. I answered to her, don't worry, in the evening, I'll go and pay. They said, Eva, you're not hearing what we are saying. We said the man say no. I laughed again. Tried to in the evening, I started doing that. When I got there, the man came out. I said, good evening. I came to pay for the lease. The man said, did they not tell you what I... I just brought out my mantle. I cleaned my face. I said to him, please, can you write how you want your name to be written in the check? The man started looking at me. I cleaned my face again with the mantle. And I said to him, please, so that we can be in a hurry today. And that was how he went inside, wrote his name, we did him a check, and we left. Coordinator was shouting. Till today, we are still in that property. That is where the free school is. That was how we got that property. The ministry of a man and special miracle. The ministry of a man and special miracle. The same God is still the same God today. He has not failed. No, he has not. Many years ago, a man traveled to his village. In his village, he was in the sitting room. All of a sudden, he was hearing not outside. Kidnappers have come. 
they had they had held the security man. The security man was now chatting, oh, guys, inside, oh, guys, inside. And his car was there. He didn't know what to do. He brought out the man to tie it on his neck. These people came into the sitting room. They didn't see him. He was sitting down there. They searched all the house. They came out and slapped the gate man. So you know your guy is not around. You told us he's around. They slapped him very well. And they left. The man was seated in his sitting room. There is nothing that God cannot do. Nothing at all. The challenge in Christendom is that we have forgotten that Christianity is a religion of power. You will say, what am I talking about? How can I say that Christianity is a religion of power? Uh -huh. Even when Jesus was living, Jesus didn't ask them to start ministry immediately. He said, wait until I give you power. He said, wait. He said, but ye shall receive power after that the Holy Ghost has come upon you. If you the house this morning, can I hear you say, Jesus is the same. If you believe it, say, Jesus is the same. Say, this same Jesus will work for me. Yeah, I say. This same Jesus. This same Jesus. <laughs> oh, yeah. This same Jesus will work for me. Whenever we say Jesus works, we have a reason saying it. We don't just say it because we want to say it. He is the God of wonders. He is the God of wonders. He is the God of wonders. He will not see you and fail. No. No. He will not see you and fail. <laughs> he will not see you. Now. There was a man of God. Called Elisha. Elisha poured water in the hands of Elijah. And the day came when Elijah would be taken off. He asked Elisha, what do you want? He said, I want a double portion of your anointing. Elijah said, you have asked for a hard thing. But nevertheless, if you see what I'm taking up, you will have it. Indeed, Elisha followed him too and saw when he was taking up. When he saw what, when he was taking up. What fell upon him was the mantle of Elijah. Little did he know that that mantle falling upon him was the symbol of the double portion. Some of us might have said in those days, how can he be that 
thing that is holding on his neck that will fall on me. What kind of thing is all of this? <laughs> But he didn't say that he understood. And look at what happened. The Bible says, He took up also the mantle of Elijah that fell on him. When? You know, when they were going, Elijah parted the waters and they passed. So when he was coming back from that trip, he needed to part the waters, he must pass. The Bible says, He took the mantle that fell from him and went back, stood by the bank of Jordan, and he took the mantle of Elijah that fell from him and did what? Smote the waters and said, Where is the Lord God of Elijah? And when he also had smitten the waters, the water parted. And Elijah went over. Elijah too became a man that can part waters because he received the mantle. Because he received the mantle, he became a man that can part the waters. <laughs> By the time we finish praying on your mantle tomorrow, you will pass waters. Every challenge that has looked insurmountable, you will pass it. You by yourself. Some of you that are listening to me now, before the next two months, Miracles would have filled up so much so in your hands that you will not know the one to describe. Because it will be miracles everywhere. Many years ago, we did a hundred days on broken prayer. By the time we are done with that prayer, we went to Fred Giant's Mountain to finish it. We did a 24 hour with the Lord. It was a beautiful program and a successful one. In fact, everybody had a testimony in that program. But as we were leaving that program, the kingdom of darkness was so annoying. So they stationed robbers on the road. As the robbers were to attack the minister's convoy, child of God, these robbers, it was a band of robbers. They came out. And normally, I actually used to tie my mantle on my hand. At times, after program, or oh, you know, anyhow, I'll just so. In fact, I think that that program we had a mantle program. Yes, we had a mantle program, so it was fresh new mantle. So I was tying mine, and as we were going, we had the robbery attack. When we had the robbery attack. The robbers came out from the bushes. They were shooting as they were coming. I stopped. <laughs> as I stopped, they came, they opened the side of my door. And immediately you opened it, the door shut. Pa, pa, pa. I thought it was time for me to go and meet with the Lord. I closed my eyes. After a while, I opened one eye. I saw I was there. I opened the door. I looked at myself. I didn't see a single blood. By that time, the robber was not bringing out a knife from his back. 
And I said to this robber, what do you want? I looked at his face. By then, all other ministers in my car were lying down on the floor. And they were already ransacking the whole car. He said, where is the money? I said, oh, that's where this one has made the mistake. Because in fact, then, we have Passover that we usually do. So whenever we are doing that Passover feast, those days, everybody used to come with 4,000 naira. So I brought out 4,000 naira and I gave it to this man. When I gave it to, to the man, it was as if there was a whistle. Everybody went back. But before then, I put one of my legs down on the floor. And I said, Lord, give me the life of the man that went with me. And they went, started going back. I was the one that was waking everybody up, telling them, stand up, stand up, stand up. They have entered the room. They robbed everybody that went with me, blue, black. They didn't take anything that belongs to me. It was a Saturday. On Monday, I was going for summer to the UK with my family. And my visa card was in the back. In, in the back. So if they had taken it, oh my God. Before you run around to get that done again, before the trip and all of that, well, that visa card was there. Now, we needed to find the other car that was in our convo. By the time we were going, by the time we saw the car, what did we see? One of my sons, Vincent by name, had been shot in the hand. And so, some other person has taken over the car, and his hand was just up. The blood was oozing out. Child of God, what saved Vincent's life? What kept the blood from oozing out? They took the mantle and they tied his hand. The blood ceased until we got to the hospital. The blood ceased until we got to the hospital. Child of God, Jesus walks. Are you in the house this morning? Can I hear you say, Jesus walks. Glory to Jesus, 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 Jesus walks. It's not by power, it's not by mind. But you need to discover before you can recover. I tell you. <laughs> mm. What we are telling you is not storylines. Because there are some people in the house that are listening to me that were first hand witnesses to what I'm saying. We don't come here making up stories. No, there's no need. Jesus has enough stories to tell. So I want you <clears throat> to say to yourself, I must testify. Believe it. Say it. Even to the mantle you have bought before we begin to pray. We're not saying that we're going to idolize handkerchiefs. No, 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 no. We're not going to idolize handkerchiefs. But everything we see in the word of God, what do we do? The only way you will know if a drug is working, is it not when you use it? Eh? If you buy a malaria drug and put it on the chair, will you know whether the malaria drug is effective or not? The only way you will know if it's effective is by the time you use it. So, that we are reading the things we are seeing in scripture. God bless you, Mrs. Zion. I know you were there. <laughs> Even Dickness is in the house. Dickness should be able to tell us that she was there. You see why we cannot just come and formulate lies and begin to tell? 
We cannot formulate it and tell because there are people that have been members of FGF for 10 years. And they know that one thing that you can identify with faith giants is testimony. And I'm going to tell you the secret to our testimony. The secret to the testimonies upon this altar is because we love Jesus anyhow. We love Jesus sheepishly. We don't look back in loving Jesus. We don't joke with loving Jesus. Yes, sir. We love him anyhow. We love him. So, if you're a new member, the secret is in loving Jesus. If you can just love him left, right, center, you will be amazed. You will become a moving testimony. Some of you that are listening to me right now, you are becoming a moving testimony. I say you will become a moving testimony to the glory of God. God is no respecter of person. God does not, you know, <clears throat> turn his back to some other people. Mm -hmm. That's why I like that song. If you run to him, he will run to you. That's it. That's how it works. That's how it works. Sometimes I tell people, we test and see that our God is good. You know what I'm
You are God from beginning to the end. There's no place for argument. You are Lord all by yourself. You are God, you are God from beginning to the end. There's no place for argument. You are God all by yourself. One other thing I have to let you know is that you should be expectant. Be expectant. Remember that we said that you got to pray over your seed. Since we announced it, you're supposed to be praying over your seed. You're supposed to be asking, you know, what needs to leave me so that this year will answer to me? So you need to pray over it. But why are you supposed to be expectant? The Bible says that the expectations of the righteous shall not be cut short. So I want you to be heavily expectant. Be heavily. He said, the desires of all nations shall come. I'm not talking about wishful thinkers. I'm talking about desires. Desire something from God this season. Desire something from God. Desire something from God. Hallelujah. We're still praying for faith and fellowship. We're going to say, Lord, Please make us your household name. Let the ark in the house spread like wildfire in the name of Jesus. Lord, let the ark in the house spread like wildfire. Oh Lord, let the ark in the house Spread like wildfire. Oh Lord, let the ark in the house spread like wildfire. Oh Lord, let the ark in the house spread like wildfire. Oh Lord, let the ark in the house spread like wildfire. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. What a wonder you are. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Daddy, what a wonder you are. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Oh, my Father, what a wonder you are. Oh, Jesus. Daddy, what a wonder you are. Oh, Jesus. Daddy, what a wonder you are. Kai. O batizi galanto robo zudo le tao shale ato la fazia. Mele de rege bo zudo lu prenda lush. Quando robo du le brada bali. Turn all the ark and the houses into miracle centers, Zulu. Please. That whenever anybody gets there, any prayer request, Father, answer them. Do your people good. Answer them. Answer them, Lord. Visit them with your goodness and mercy. Yes, Lord. Daddy, do it so that your name will be magnified. Do it so that your name will be lifted on high. Do it, Lord. Do it. Turn the ark and the houses to miracle centers. Oh, yes. Lord, please. Bless. Abundantly. 
beyond every of your imagination. All the ark in the house volunteer. Bless them. Father, bless them indeed. Bless them. Father, bless them indeed. Bless them. Father, bless them indeed. Bless them. Bless them indeed. Father, bless them indeed. Father, bless them indeed. Father, bless them. Bless them. Bless them. Lord, bless them. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Bless them indeed. 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 Bless them. Bless them. Bless them. Bless them. Bless them. It's all about you, Jesus. It's all about you. It's all about you. It's all about you. It's all about you. Oh, yes. Father, please make all our partners global lenders. Turn our partners to global lenders. Turn our partners to global lenders. Oh, yes. Mara dazuzo le grebebali. Mande zegebo shaladaria. Oh, legere gedebo fialadaria andaroshia. Turn all our partners, Lord, to financial magnets. Turn them to financial magnets in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Mala rufi on Sunday Batutia. Kade Iledori Basutoki la Bosch, Alatuya. Pende Rage Badu, so Dorabo Rufre de Gede, Shiando. Ole Teru Vianda Laticia Kata. Father, do it so that your name will be glorified. It's all about you. Jesus is all about you. It's all about you. Daddy is all about you. Please turn our partners to global lenders. Turn all of our partners. All of our partners, make them global lenders, turn them to a global phenomenon. Make them financial magnets in the name of Jesus. Beautify their life with peace on all sides. Prosper their ways and bless them indeed. Enlarge their coast beyond their wildest imagination. Father, Lord, frustrate every enemy of their testimonies and glorious destinies. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Zakule pota otalakari. Odedende. Isakoto le crasso to porti andelete. E de gusinda un palicarota. O se il levo to tunga le branda la roti. Are che je lutande le trolo pocusi. In the name of Jesus. Oh Lord. Please. Give us men and women. Oh yes. That will run with the vision. In the name of Jesus. Oh. Mandara lazo don delegebo. Men and women that will run with the vision. Lord, give them to us. Give them to us. Give them to us. Give them to us. Give them to us, give them to us, give them to us, give them to us. Give them to us, give them to us. In the name of Jesus Christ. Give us the gates of nations. Give us the gates of nations. Give us the gates of nations. In the mighty name of Jesus. Give us the gates of nations. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, frustrate. Everything that is frustrating any member of a giant fellowship worldwide. Father, frustrate those things. Frustrate those things. Frustrate those things. Anything that is frustrating any member of faith giant fellowship worldwide, daddy frustrate them. 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 In the name of Jesus. Father Lord, settle all our singles. Oh yes, please settle our singles, settle our singles, settle our singles, settle our singles, settle them, settle them, settle them, settle them, settle them, settle them. 
Oh yes, give them good hopes. Give them peaceful hopes. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Father, give them peaceful hopes. Give them good hopes. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lebrosu kaba batonzia. Ela daro lia sokabula. Ero putenga do bele suti. Egere de suta la daro shandale. Ela go prada kitanda teko suto povo. Erebos! You are God over all. There is none to compare like unto you. You are Jehovah, you are not a man. You are the I am that I am. The lion of the tribe of Judah. The lily of the valley and rose of Sharon. Arise, Lord, arise, and do that which no man can do. Ye can tokuki yata. Elele ya kasi sakupa katuto intala tutia. Kare gebo shutia. O tele grusha dala branda luz. Lord, give our children academic excellence. Oh yes, parege bozo do lebre de bozo do litra la gadazi andebo. Tande re bozo do lebre de bale de bozo do lege de gilatari. Panda raga baze de lebre de bozo do lebre de boshia. Tande lege de. Oh yes, our children shall be first among equals. They will be the head. They will not be the tail. They will be protected by Jehovah. Oh, academically, they will excel. They will not be found in wrong companies. In the name of Jesus, our children will serve the Lord. Our children will love the Lord. Our children will be properly behaved. In the mighty name of Jesus, lift up your voice. Pray for our children. Pray for our children. Pray for our children. Oh, yes. Our children will take up the seats of leadership. Oh, they are the future presidents, governors, ministers. We decree and we declare over their lives. Nazanga Luntore Batulia. They will stand out to the glory of the living God. Oh, we will not cast our young. None of our children will die the death of another. Oh, they will not be cut off in their prime. They will live till a good old age. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We decree and we declare over our children. Goodness and mercy shall follow them. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Male rupakute le suta labrale toke. E dalusen de labrada boshale. E regede salo tanga labati. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Our children will not be rebellious. Oh no. Lekata tatupia. Asa tatute ete. Rukata seti. Yanda legredeba. Our children shall be pay setters and trade blazers. They will be the influencers of their generation. No, the society will not influence them negatively. Never. To the glory of the living God. Ise te upa. Okata ria. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, there is none holier than Lord. There is none besides thee. Neither is there any rock like my God. There is none. Holy as the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Abba Father. In Jesus' most powerful name we pray. Amen, amen, amen. Our devotional this morning, Giant Saints, the topic says, Winning in Crisis Situations. You and I will bear witness that the world that we are living in today is filled with different forms of crisis. But I bless God that we know Him. 
How many of you are, glow, are, are, are very happy that you know Jesus? Can I hear you say, Father, thank you. Because we're not better than the people that don't know him, that's the truth. It is a privilege to know, love, and serve Jesus. It is a privilege. It is a privilege. It is a privilege to know, love, and serve Jesus. So this morning we are looking at winning in crisis situation. And our text through memory verse is taken from 2 Corinthians chapter number 1 and verse 20. For all the promises of God in him are yea and ye amen. Unto the glory of God by us. Hallelujah. All his promises are yea and amen. You see, for some time now, it is obvious that the Lord is trying to make us build trust in him. I think that's what the Lord is trying to make us do. Because when you know that anything you see in scripture is here and amen, oh, you will go for it. That's the truth. You will go for it. I've never seen any scripture fail. Scriptures don't fail. Today the Lord actually showed us that so mightily good the word of God has been good. You might be facing a situation right now. But I want to tell you that the word of God will prevail for you. The word of God will prevail in that situation. The word of God will prevail in your life. The word of God will prevail and you will have reason to bless the name of the Lord, your God. He said, for all the promises of God in him are yea and in him, amen, unto the glory of God by us. It is the development of your love and faith using the blood, the word, and the spirit on a regular and consistent basis that enables you to supernaturally win in the middle of a crisis situation. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Since we started the fasting and the midnight prayer, we have been using the blood. We have been using the blood. The anointing oil represents the spirit. I hope you know. We have been using the spirit. Child of God, of course we have been using the word. Because we have been praying in accordance to scriptures. Oh, child of God, consistently we have been doing this for almost 40 days now. Child of God, you will all return with an evidence. You will win. I tell you today, you will win. You're coming out as the victor in that situation. It will end in prayer. You are more than a conqueror. Our prayer today is very simple. Father, I thank you for making me win at all times. Can someone lift up their voice and say, Lord? I thank you for making me win at all times. I thank you. Thank you. Thank you for making me win all of the times. Always making me weak. Father, I am grateful. I am grateful. If it has not been the Lord who was on my side, child of God, of course, the enemy would have buffeted with our glorious destiny. But we bless God that he has never failed and he will not see us and become a failure. Hallelujah. Lift up your voice and begin to say thank you, Jesus, for what he has done for us tonight. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus, for wiping away our tears. He can only be God. He can only be God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus, for shedding your blood. Oh, yes. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Lift up your voice and thank this God for all that he has done. Thank you, Jesus, for answered prayers in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. 
Hallelujah. We cannot leave the prayer altar without saying Jesus must be famous. We cannot leave the prayer altar without doing that because we are Jesus advertisers. We are Jesus advertisers. Praise God. He's an awesome God, always doing beautiful things. He's a faithful God. He has never failed. He will not see us and fail. Hallelujah. He's a good God and a kind God. He's an awesome God. He's a beautiful King. Father, we thank you because you hear us always whenever we call. We thank you because you have been God over our lives and God over all. Father, we appreciate you. Blessed be your name for what you have once again done tonight. In Jesus' most powerful name, we pray. Amen, 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 and amen. Children of the Most High God, you are blessed and you are highly favored. The blessings of the Lord that make it rich and added no sorrow remains your portion. Your going out and your coming in in this week is blessed. Oh yes, this week you would have an encounter with the God of wonders and you will know the meaning of the kindness of Jehovah to the glory of his holy name. You will surely return with an evidence because God is no respecter of person and he will not see you and become a liar. At all, God does not lie. I see you dancing the dance of victory. I see you coming to God with a testimony on your lips to the glory of his holy name. You are all blessed and you are highly favored. Amen. Once again, I want to apologize for coming on late tonight. Oh no. Tomorrow night will be on time and I want to encourage you. Come in with your friends, with your loved ones, with your family. One thing I want you to know is that as a Jesus lover, you have to keep telling somebody about Jesus on a daily basis. We are all called to be soul winners. But in this situation, we want to deal with a lot of things. We want to deal with joblessness tomorrow night, that the Lord should give our loved ones beautiful jobs. We want to deal with marital delay. Singles come with double mantle. We want to deal with barrenness. We want to call forth your children. Tomorrow night is a night of complete settlement. Complete settlement. We are coming to settle it. Now, tomorrow night again is also our night that we will be picking scripture prophecy. Immediately I see your name, I pick a scripture prophecy for you. Amen. So, and that is the scripture prophecy you got to run through this year with. The word of God is a more sure word of prophecy. Then again, as for your seed, let me say something about seed. No matter how you pray and fast, if you're holding your seed in your hand and you don't plant it, it cannot germinate. So it is the night that we are coming to put a seed on the ground that we have cultivated in these past 40 days, asking the Lord, Father, do something for us this year, exceedingly abundantly more than we can ever hope or believe in. You are next in line for a glorious testimony. You are blessed, child of God, and you are highly favored. Amen.